We only became aware we would be undressing next to a man was when we had to see a man undressing while we were simultaneously undressing. And so I immediately left the locker room and I went up to one of the officials on the pool deck and I said, what are the guidelines to allow a man into our locker room? And he so nonchalantly said back, oh, we actually got around this by making locker rooms unisex. First and foremost, you just admitted this is a male by acknowledging how you had to change your rules to make the locker rooms unisex. Secondly, unisex, any man could have walked into our locker room. Any coach, any official, any man who wanted to would have had full reins. This is called women's sports for a reason because they belong to women and women have been fighting to have an equal right to play sports and have a space that's theirs and feel comfortable in it. And it belongs to them for so long. And now it just takes a few mediocre male athletes to say that they want to change their identities, come in and literally ruin decades and decades of groundwork that has been laid. It's just really ridiculous.